I've trapped a few bear in my career, but this one was pretty worked up. We we're hoping those tranquilizers work. In Heartland, Maine, the Unity College Bear Study is about to get their first glimpse of a live black bear. Looks like the tranquilizers are working, but they need to proceed with caution. I just touch, touch near her eyes there just to see. The bear's out cold. Yeah, the scruff of the neck. Lay it on its left side. Once the bear's out of the trap, the team jumps into action. They're monitoring the bear closely, heart rate, temperatures. It's no different than you or I going in, maybe getting a little uh, Novocaine and uh, having a tooth filled or cleaned, and after a while, the uh, numbness wears off. No different here. It's an adult male, approximately 300 pounds. The bear study is only interested in tracking females and cubs, so they won't be putting a collar on this bear. But the biological data they collect from it will be useful in assessing the bear population in Maine. Putting the tags in the ears now, protected the eyes, so you don't have a good blink reflex when they're under. They're monitoring its vital signs to make sure that it doesn't get overheated, that it's breathing properly. They check the bear's teeth. If they can get one out, they'll be able to learn how old it is. As they are working to extract the tooth, the bear licks George's hand. I don't like that. Yeah. Not a good sign. Everyone is instructed to back away. When they're starting to react like that, lifting their head, kind of becoming conscious, you just kind of want to back off what you're doing. The bear should have been under for longer. Maybe it didn't get the full dose, in which case they may have an angry and alert bear on their hands. It appears to be sedated still, but it's too dangerous now to continue their work. They won't tempt fate twice. seems groggy, but otherwise OK. A lot of people involved, and a lot of people will get to learn some valuable information here today, even including myself. So uh, very excited to be part of this. After a few minutes, he bounds back into the woods, no worse for wear.